Well, you can either get better with a bow, or try to learn from me. I'm still... Thank you for coming. Yes, youngling. Have a seat. I hear you've been busy of late. Lass, I know what you've been up to. Mind you, it's no business of mine what each companion does in the name of honor. But this sneaking around... It does not befit warriors of your standing. Aella knows better, and so should you. In any case, I have a task for you. Have you heard the story of how we came to be werewolves? Aye, that sounds like him. As in all matters of faith, though, the reality is more complicated than one believer would tell you. The companions are nearly 5,000 years old. This matter of beast blood has only troubled us for a few hundred. One of my predecessors was a good but short-sighted man. He made a bargain with the witches of Glenmoral Coven. If the companions would hunt in the name of their lord Hirsin, we would be granted great power. They did not believe the change would be permanent. The witches offered payment, like anyone else. But we had been deceived. The witches didn't lie, of course, but it's more than our bodies. The disease, you see, affects not just our bodies, it seeps into the spirit. Upon death, werewolves are claimed by Hirsing for his hunting grounds. For some, this is a paradise. They want nothing more than to chase prey with their master for eternity. That is their choice, but I am still a true Nord, and I wish for Sovngarde as my spirit home. That's what I've spent my twilight years trying to find out. And now I've found the answer. The witch's magic ensnared us, and only their magic can release us. They won't give it willingly, but we can extract their foul powers by force. I want you to seek them out. Go to their coven in the wilderness. Strike them down as a true warrior of the wild. And bring me their heads, the seat of their abilities. From there, we may begin to undo centuries of impurity. You shall have no shield, brother, this time. But the spirit of Isgamor goes with you to restore the honor of his legacy. Talos guide you, lass.
trust I couldn't watch the Stormcloaks tearing clear everything out. apart and not do something. Most of my family disagrees with you.
heard they're reforming the Dawn God. Vampire hunters or something. For we are one. Ere you ascended, and the eight became nine. You won't come to chat with her. These two finally had the nerve to attack your vats. We got most. Where have you been? I hope it was important, because it means you weren't here to defend him. The Silver Hand. They finally found enough courage to attack Yorvaskar. We fought them off, but... The old man, Kotlak, is dead. No, but they made off with all our fragments of Wuthrad. But you and I are going to reclaim them. We will bring the battle to their chief camp. There will be none left living to tell their stories. Only songs of Yorvaskar will be sung. We will avenge Kodlak, and they will know terror before the end.
want, huh? Leave here alive. Huh? Over here! 
The others have probably prepared Kodlak's funeral by now. Come up to the Sky Forge to pay your respects. Oh, intending your hounds? You smell like a wet dog. Flame. We, we grieve. grieve. We, we grieve. grieve. At this loss, we, we weep. We weep. For the fallen, we, we shout. shout. And for ourselves, we, we take, take our, take our, our leave. leave. His spirit is departed. Members of the Circle, let us withdraw to the Underforge to grieve our last together. Do you have the fragments of Uthrad still? I'll need to prepare them for mounting again. Don't get too flowery on me, lass. Of course, I have a small favor to ask of you. There's another piece that Kodlak always kept close to himself. Would you go to his chambers and bring it back for me? I'm not sure I'm the best one to go through his things. I appreciate it. White Run belongs to the true sons of Skyrim now, just as it should. Your shield siblings have withdrawn to the Underforge. I think they're waiting for you. The old man had one wish before he died, and he didn't get it. It's as simple as that. Being Moonborn is not so much of a curse as you might think, Vilkis. That's fine for you. But he wanted to be clean. He wanted to meet Iskramor and know the glories of Sovngarde. But all that was taken from him. And you avenged him? Kodlak did not care for vengeance. No, Farkas, he didn't. And that's not what this is about. We should be honoring Kodlak, no matter our own thoughts on the blood. You're right. It's what he wanted. He deserved to have it. 
Godlag used to speak of a way to cleanse his soul, even in death. You know the legends of the tomb of Iskramor. There, the souls of the Harbingers will heed the call of Northern Steel. We can't even enter the tomb without Uthrad. And it's in pieces, like it has been for a thousand years. And dragons were just stories, and the elves once ruled Skyrim. Just because something is, doesn't mean it must be. The blade is a weapon, a tool. Tools are meant to be broken and repaired. Is that... Did you repair the blade? This is the first time I've had all the pieces, thanks to our shield sister here. The flames of Hero can reforge the Shattered. The flames of Kodlak shall fuel the rebirth of Uthrad, and now it will take you to meet him once more. As the one who bore the fragments, I think you should be the one to carry Uthrad into battle. The rest of you, prepare to journey to the tomb of Ysgrimmon, for Kodlak. My job is to serve the Jarl, not waste time talking to travelers. This is the resting place of Iskramor, and its most trusted generals. You should be cautious. Kodlak was right. I let vengeance rule my heart. I regret nothing of what we did at Driftshade. But I can't go any further with my mind fogged, or my heart grieved. The original companions, their finest warriors rest with Ysgramor. 
You'll have to prove yourselves to them. It's not that you're intruding. I'd wager they've actually expected us. They just want to be sure that you're worthy. Be ready for an honorable battle. Return Wuthra to Iskramor. It should open the way. Aye. further, Shield Sister. Ever since Dustman's Cairn, the big crawly ones have been too much for me. Everyone has his weakness, and this one is mine. I'm not proud, but I will stay back with Vilkas. Give my regards to Ysgrimor. Never 
Who dares dispute? <laughs> Greetings, Shield Sister. Of course, my fellow Harbingers and I have been warming ourselves here, trying to evade Husey. You see only me because your heart knows only me as the Companion's leader. I'd wager old Vignar could see half a dozen of my predecessors. And I see them all. The ones in Sovngarde, the ones trapped with me in Hirsi's realm. And they all see you. You've brought honor to the name of the Companions. We won't soon forget it. Did he now? I can only hope. You still have the Witch's heads. Excellent. Throw one of them into the fire. It will release their magic. For me, at least. Thank you for this gift. The other Harbingers remain trapped by Hirsing. Perhaps from Sovngarde, the heroes of old can join me in their rescue. The harrowing of the hunting grounds. It would be a battle of such triumph. And perhaps someday, you'll join us in that battle. But for today, return to your vessel. Triumph in your victory. And lead the companions to further glory. Did I hear right? Did he say you were to lead the companions? You've earned the right. Your strength and honor are apparent to all. And it's my honor to be first to address you as Harbinger. Let's go tell the others. You're someone who can get things done. I like that.
been a good friend to me. That means something. Oh, you don't have to worry about any problems from me. I do what I'm told. Congratulations. We've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle over in the Rift. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? Go. Bring honor to yourself, and the companions. I wouldn't have expected someone like you to be the harbinger. Come to me with questions. I know our history almost as well as Vignar by now. Except I can remember it. If you had told me a few months ago that some outsider I had never heard of would lead the companions, I might have slit your throat. But I've seen what you can do, and heard of the love that Kadlak had for you. The trust. Let's hope you can show that his heart was not deceived. Good luck, my friend. Not right now. I'm going to look at some of these carvings. I wonder if Ysgramor ever set foot here while he was alive. But you don't have to stay if you don't want to. I'll see you back at the Orvasker. Stories to tell the others, eh? Yes, you brought honor to him, even after his death. A worthy outcome for a worthy warrior. Aye.